So let's talk first and foremost about what we just heard from Eli and our Kieran Dillon in NY17. One of the most contentious seats here, and it really is coming down to the wire. It's going to be all about the turnout here from Mike Lawler versus Mondaire Jones here. Let me get your thoughts right now on what exactly you're thinking of in terms of, of who's going to uh, sweep this one out. Well, it's hard to say because it is a very close race, and it was expected to be a close race. I mean, Mondaire Jones had the seat prior uh, under when the district was very different than redistricting. He moved, came back to the district. So it's kind of hard to say. But what is clear is that both have tried to ch chart out that centrist lane, that bipartisan lane. And so they both are really kind of going after that same middle voter. They both are going after the same voter. You know, in our most recent poll, too, it, it, the top three issues, and this is really what we're seeing play out across the country, was the economy, democracy, abortion, immigration, right? So where did the candidate stand on those issues, and was that the driving point on what led people to the polls? Well, um, like you said, I think those are the driving issues in a lot of races. I do not necessarily think that's the difference in a race like this, yeah. right? Um, congressional races are, you have to deal with the top of the ticket and the weighty federal issues, but they're really local races, and candidates matter. Uh, Lawler, they've both been fighting for that moderate bipartisan um, uh, lane, but uh, Congressman Lawler has always been that way in office. Uh, when he was in the assembly, he took a lot of votes uh, that conservative Republicans did not like. He remains very close to the district and the people in the district. He's everywhere. He knows, you know, he is with every group. He is, um, you know, he's got a lot of support there, and he's just been working. He's a hustler, and he's, you know, he knows how to campaign, and he knows how to campaign well. And I don't think Mondaire is as good a candidate, regardless of the issues. What's interesting here is that actually Biden won the district, mm -hmm. but Lawler won. So it was, yes. it was a split, a split yep. here. You both